Hello YouTube, this is Ryan again. I'm the developer of Zoa, and Zoa is a creative MIDI sequencer for iOS and Mac OS that implements Conway's Game of Life in, I think, a, a pretty creative way. So what I'm gonna show you is how to do some creative arpeggiation, and I'm also gonna show you how to use the rule settings on the playheads over here. So you'll notice I've got the auto advance setting disabled. And if I hit play, I've only got this first playhead going. And let's see what this up rule does. So you can see that the up rule just goes up through the cells and comes back down at the bottom when it's done. Let's change that to down. doesn't sound too interesting, but with auto advance enabled, you can get, I think, some really interesting stuff out of first. And we also have last, which plays the last living note. We have random, which chooses a random note. We have walk, which will either go down, play the same note, or go up using random chance. Rise, which I like, which goes up two, down one. And last but not least, we've got Fall, which goes down two, up one. really nice. So you can see that with Auto Advanced disabled, you can use it kind of like a creative arpeggiator, and I showed you how to use the rules to get some interesting patterns out of those. And we also saw that you can have two playheads overlap in a really unique and interesting way. So thanks for watching. Hope this video gives you some ideas, and I just hope that uh, if you are out there trying Zoa. Hopefully it inspires you to make some music, to explore sound, and just have some fun. So thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.